Hey, uh, Jedi Seth here. I wanted to show you my new build. Um, this one I've actually uh, completed most of it quite a while ago and just didn't have time to build a chassis for it. Um, or I, I did have time, I just started working on other projects and decided to come back to it. It's uh, running a Prism 5.1. It has a RGB LED, um, Luxian LED, and then it has a RGB uh, LED for the crystal. So. It's got the changing capabilities. It's got a Relmaster speaker. Um, as you can see, it's uh, heavily covered in A in A14 aluminum black, and then I've sanded a lot of it off. Um, it's got some painted grooves here. I I paint pictures for a living, and I I like painting oil paintings, and, and so I, this is oil paint. Um, I typically don't like paint on sabers. In general but I thought you know that might look good if I put that in those grooves and so it's got some red paint here that is dried and then after it dried I went over it with black and then just before the black dried I started wiping off areas of the black so the red would show through in it thought it looked pretty good it's got a cool look to it um, here's the uh, cover tech that has a D ring that I drilled out and it's uh it's on there pretty good doesn't really shake around or or rattle or hit the saber. It will a little bit, but not too bad. It's, I got a uh, some tactile switches that are flush there. Um, TCS bunny ears. Uh, I made a shroud. It's got kind of a fork in the middle here. Here's my custom blade plug. It's like the last one I built. Um, it's kind of like a turbine. It's pretty cool. Um, I'll show you the, the chassis. There's the chassis that I made for this saber um, with the crystal. Um, crystal chamber, here's the, there's got a little more details on this one that I did the last one. There's some holes here. There's a window with some accent LEDs. It's got my um, flush uh, kill key that I like to do. Uh, there's the real master speaker. Um, put some uh, lines in here with the lathe, just some decorative lines. Um, here's kind of a kind of a detail here I put on the sides um, along with some holes that were drilled. Um, let's get the kill key. Time to die. I have my custom kill key. It's red. Um, power on. <laughs> So yeah, it's uh, the RGB is really one of the neatest features, I, in my opinion, that the Prism board has. And then it's got the color changing capabilities, and so whatever the, you change the color on the blade, also the crystal will change that same color. So it just mimics the blade color. Really like it. Anyway, there it is, accent LEDs doing their thing, bouncing around there, flashing. Anyway, that's my saber. That's my custom sound font. It's on the saber font. It's a uh, enforcer, I think that one is. Anyway, that's my new build. I get a lot. Of, I have a lot of fun building these. It's it's really enjoyable. Prison board's really quite easy. In fact, when I had this prison board all wired up. Um, I got it all finished and I thought, what the heck did I do wrong? Because it wasn't working and I knew I did it right. So I actually had to go look at the manual to make sure I wired it correctly. And after about 20 minutes, I figured out I didn't have the SD card in. So yeah, you always got to remember to put in the SD card. Anyway, that's my new Sabre. Thank you for watching.